What's up everyone, ETS here. Welcome back to the channel, guys. And in today's video, we're gonna be opening four of the Pokemon Pikachu V Box collections from Shining Fates. And not only that, but we are gonna be testing if you can weigh these packs. So that way, if you guys are buying loose packs online, we're gonna make sure you guys do not get scammed. So let's take a look at what we got. All right, so here's our box. You can't see it all, but this is from PokemonCenter.com. Apparently, this might have six boxes because, um, I don't know, they might have messed up. We'll see if they messed up. It'll be great for us, but I'm going to open it and I'll let you guys know in a second. All right, guys, the box is open and let's take them out. So we have one, two, three, four. Yep, only four. All right, good. Well, not good, but we wanted six. Well, that's good to know that they did not mess it up, I guess. All right, so we have four boxes. I'm going to open them all up, and then we will weigh the packs. And here is the front of the box. If you're interested, get your Pikachu promo, the jumbo card, and four packs. And here is the back. Looks pretty cool in the back. All right, let's get into these. And also, just a heads up, people think these are resealed, but apparently there's been issues with glue, so we will find out if these have been resealed or not. Alright, so in box number one, we get our Pikachu, get our Jumbo card, and we get four packs. Let me get them out. Three of them are draggable, that's cool. And you get your code card for the box, here you go. And let's toss this, and I'm gonna speed open the rest of these, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I've opened every box, and just real quick, in case you guys missed the codes, here they are. Um, I think this is all of them for the Pikachu box. Yep, that should be all of them. And now let's weigh these packs. So the way I'm going to do this, I'm going to use my little scale here and we're going to sort them by weight and we will open from lightest to heaviest and we'll see if it makes a difference. And this is just educational. Do not weigh your own packs and sell them. I am doing this so that way you guys do not get scammed buying single packs online or anything like that. Yeah, And from my prediction, I do not think these will be weighable, so... We're going to test that theory today. There we go. You can see the number now. All right, let's start weighing them. We have a 22.42, 22.62, dang, that's a big one, let me move these over, let's see how well I can remember the weights, uh, let's see, next one, 22.62, so that's almost 5, we'll put the heavy ones down here, yeah, Next up, 22.28, so I think that is our lightest one so far. Twenty-two point two two. that is our new lightest. Point two point four nine. that's another one that is pretty close. So I'm gonna put it on top of this one. Whoa, uh, why is this thing like this? All right, fixed. Weights might be inaccurate because of that. All right, 22.52, pretty close to this one. 22.42. I think that's the same as this one. 22.28, that's about the same as that. 22.4, that's another one similar to this. 
22.25. So that one will go right here. We have two packs left. 22.25, that's another. And last pack, 22.3, so about the same weight as that one. All right, we have finished weighing and let's start testing. So we are gonna be starting with the lightest pack, which is this toxicity pack here. My prediction is weights will not matter. I don't think the difference is big enough, but let's, we're gonna find out. And also the goal today is to get the Charizard. Here's the code. Come on, zoom in. There you go. Yeah, number one goal, get that Charizard so I can be done with the set. Do our usual four cards to the back. All right, everything is like off, out of focus today. We got fire energy. Yeah, this is all out of focus. The Wacky, Gym Trainer, Luxio, Cuffin, Snom, Yanma, Eevee, more Pico, Verse Decidueye, and Yen Mega. Nothing on that pack, so that means Wang is looking good right now. Or bad, actually, because we do not want them to be weighable. Alright, pack number two. When I tested all the weights individually, it didn't seem like it was weighable. However, we might be wrong. But that's the point of this, we're gonna find out. So this one was around 22.25, I believe. All right, we got Darkness Energy. We got Rodham, Gym Trainer, Tropius, Morpico, Choodle, Rowlet, Trap Inch, Coughing, Verse Thwacky and Volcanion. Nothing out of that one either. The, so these might be weighable. All right. This one was around the same weight. Here's your code. Toss that. All right, one, two, three, four. Get a Water Energy, Rust and Sword, Rotom, Cramorant, more Pico, Yanma, Horsey, Shinx, Spinarak, Versus Rude, and Dreadnought. All right, so things are either looking like I'm getting terrible luck or you can actually weigh stuff. I'm gonna stop the recording real quick. I'll be right back. All right, let's move on. These ones are around 22.3. Let's hope we start getting some stuff. That'd be nice. Oops, backwards. There you go. So right now it's looking like our heavy packs might have some of the good stuff. Ball Guy, Dartrix, Eevee, Rallet, Shinx, Trap Inch, Yanma, oh, Shiny Corviknight, and Celebi. All right, so that one was a step up. That's nice. I will put this back here for now, and I will sleeve that up later. So if the weights are right, these other two packs in the same category, they should also have a shiny hollow, probably. We're gonna find out though. Here's your code. Yeah, so if the math is right, this should also be a hollow shiny or baby shiny, whatever you want to call it. Team Yell, Gym Trainer, Trap Inch, Snom, Gossifleur, Cacnea, Coughing, Reverse Indeedy. Oh, Alchemy VMAX Secret Rare. That's crazy. Okay, so this was one of the lighter packs. All right, let me get a sleeve for this. So does that deconfirm pack weighing? I don't know. It could. If the Alchemy VMAX just weighs less, it could. But that is a great pull. I will definitely take that. That is the only secret rare in the set, I believe. So good pull for sure. We'll put that right on top of that. 
and we will put this off to the side. So if those shiny baby cards in the VMAX, if they weigh the same, then this one should also have a VMAX or baby shiny. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> Fighting Energy, Gym Trainer, Tropius, Team Yell, Snom, Gossiflor, Cuffin, Spinarak, Choodle, Reverse Cuffin, and Decidueye Hollow. Okay, not bad. So out of that pack, out of the 22.29 slash 22.23s, or not 2.3, um, 22.30. All of those had a hit in it. It was only one hit, but it was still a hit. So out of this one, this one was like 3-2, I think. I think this one will also have a, a high... What am I saying? I think this one will also have a hollow or a baby shiny in it. Or maybe another alchemy. We'll see. Because the weights are similar, but I'm not sure if... It'll be exactly the same. All right, here we go. Flutter Energy, Tropius, Eldios, Rust and Shield, Snom, Gossifor, Coffin, Spinarak, Choodle, Shinx, and Celebi. Okay, that had nothing in it. It's kind of weird, but all right. That looks like it goes against our weighing. All right, I forget how much this one was. I want to say it was like a 3.9. So I don't really know what to expect anymore. However, out of the 22.29s and 3s, we got hits. But the one that was heavier did not give us a hit. Very weird. My personal hope is that these are not weighable, but... um. There's various ways of weighing, like you can sort it by like category, you can just find the heaviest. So there might be certain categories that have better hits than others. We got a Weasel, Morpico, Reverse Trap Inch, and Coughing, not Coughing, uh, Galarian Wheezing Hollow. Alright. So that was a hit. And let's move on. So we are definitely getting better stuff than from the first category of like the low 22.2s. This pack will not open. But is it really going to be better than that Alchemy? I don't know. Here's your code. One, two, three, four. Got a Grass Energy. Floatzel, Rodham, Rusted Shield, Shinx, Spinarak, Weasel, Cuffin, Cacnea, ooh, Shiny Decidueye, and Boss's Orders. All right, we're starting to get some better stuff. Oh, dropped a card. How many packs do we have left? We have seven left, I think. All right, this category right here, I believe these were like the three nines slash fours. This could be a pretty good one. I don't know. Let's find out. I'm just really hoping for that Charizard. That's the only thing left I really want from the set. I already have all the dittos and I do not really want any of the other shiny ones except for Charizard. Everyone wants Charizard, but that it's the one I want too, so. Hollow Rillaboom, all right. One thing you notice from the set is you get a lot of the same common cards and non-hollow rares, but from opening this so far, Shining Fates is a very fun set to open. Like you get so many good stuff from it, like so many good pulls. This video isn't really showing it yet, but that might be because, might be because, I cannot talk. But that might be because, um, the heavier packs might have some of the good stuff. I'm going to find out pretty soon. 
verse and we got a ditto v card that's our first v card of the video i'll put that here all right come on let's get at least like one shiny v max or v card or something maybe a full art skyla i take that for sure these packs open kind of weird maybe even a gold card gold card would be nice Uh, there's two, um, yeah, there's two gold cards. There's a, there's the Eternatus and the Eternatus VMAX. Both of them look sick. It's like the gold and black. Gold, no, what am I saying? Electric Energy, Dartrix, Eldegoss, Rustin Sword, Nicket, Trap Inch, Snom, Gossifer, Cacnea, Shiny Score Bunny, and Crobat VMAX. Unfortunately, I already have this one. Did I get this one? I'm not sure. Hold on, what's at the bottom of this? It's a little bit of whitening at the bottom, I think. Other than that, that was a really good pack, though. That was out of the 22.4, I think. Alright, uh, we're moving on to the 22.5. I probably should have kept better track of these, but it's too late now. Uh, let's get that Charizard. Got a Metal Energy, Tropius, Floatzel, Rotom, Shinx, Weasel, Nicket, Trap Inch, Snom, Reverse, Pokemon Center, or what I'm going to say, Professor's Research, and Crobat V. This card is probably the best V card you can get because I think it's like a meta card in the card game. So, good pull there. We have three packs left. Come on. Let's get something good. We gotta end the video on a banger. The best way to do that is to get that Charizard. Or Skyla. Skyla's the second best one. Electric Energy, Rodham, Dartrix, Floatzel, Rowlet, Shinx, Trap Inch, Yanma. Weasel. Ooh, shiny Meowth and Luxray Hollow. That's kind of a cool looking card. I like that. Yeah, so we're definitely getting more hits now. But we have yet to pull a V Max or a shiny V. But we have two packs to do it. One, two, three, four. Electric Energy, Rust and Shield, Cramorant, Dartrix, Cacnea, Cuffin, Weasel, Morpico, Eevee, I think this is a reverse, Coughing, and Decidueye. Yeah, so I don't really know if Wang Packs is working. Because we're getting mixed results. But those really light packs, you can definitely weigh those. Because we got four of them, I think, so far that had nothing. So, like, the super light ones, those definitely are weighable, I think, in, like, a bad way. But the good thing is most packs will have stuff from the looks of it. Snom, Horsey, Nicket, Eevee, Choodle. Shiny Ditto V and Greedent Floor. So our heaviest pack, that was a good one. So maybe you can weigh them. It's kind of hard to tell because we didn't have a ton of packs to work with. But our best pull was definitely out of that last pack. All right, guys, that's going to end the video for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to like, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye, everyone.